Hey, what's up, YouTube? Real quick, here's an NES whose composite video output is streaked versus one that's working properly. Notice the white horizontal streaking around the title Super Mario World. Well, well, look at what we have here. Two leaking capacitors. and a third leaking capacitor. This group of capacitors looks okay. Yup, just a dust bunny. Okay, so let's remove the leaking capacitors. Now to test the integrity of the pads with continuity tests. I made my own capacitor recap set from Mauser. The capacitor list complete with part numbers are in the video description. I measured all the old caps and made sure they were the same sizes.
I like to make sure and test the integrity of my soldering. I'm curious to see if the leak capacitors is causing the issue. This confirms it has to be the coupling cap. Okay, I removed the rest of the capacitors. and I installed the rest of the capacitors. Oh, don't forget about the sound module. The anode pad is silk screened on the board. By the way, I was solder certified for a previous job, and this technique will fail you your solder certification. But you know what, it works, and I recommend this to beginners. My first full recap 